All right, Coach, obviously another tough oh. loss tonight. You guys hang in there with them, battle back for three periods, great back and forth hockey, get into overtime. Uh, overall thoughts on the game, any positives you can take out from tonight? Well, yeah, I know there's obviously a lot of positives. We erased, I believe, four one-goal leads throughout the game, but, you know, it's the same message. You know, it's getting old. We have to find ways at that point of the game, once we battle that hard to make it 4-4, to uh, take that next step to take the lead and hold it. So, you know, Credit to the resiliency coming back. Uh, you know, credit to the effort. But at the end of the day, it's still not good enough. We got to find a way uh, to get two points on the board. Some incredible players out there for you tonight. Uh, one in particular, Corbin Baldwin. He's had a, kind of a quiet season, maybe stat-wise, but he's out there. He blocked probably a good dozen shots tonight. Just talk about what Corbin's been doing, kind of silently and steady for you guys so far. He's he's been very steady. Uh, I mean, you see him on the penalty kill. You see him five on five. Uh, he puts his body on the line every night and. Uh, you know, it's guys like that that, you know, we need to appreciate by sealing the win. And, you know, he doesn't get uh, the credentials or the, you know, all the points or the recognition. So, you know, he gets his enjoyment off wins. And that's ultimately what we need to do right now. We just need to win. And your points tonight came from the line of Amuma, Alain Jefferson Dahl, and Rob Linsmeyer. How incredible were they for you tonight? Yeah, no, they were really uh, uh, dynamic and they created a lot. And, uh, you know, we have a balanced attack up front, you know, there's no question about that. It's uh, at certain times we just need to continue to think smart through the neutral zone, uh, defend in the D zone and, you know, until we can tighten up those areas and uh, it's, there's going to be some ups and downs. One more with Atlanta tomorrow night, very special night, obviously being military appreciation night. What are the big keys for you guys tomorrow to finally get that, uh, you know, monkey off your back, so to speak, and get one this weekend? Well, yeah, I mean, I don't know if it's necessarily a monkey on our back. You know, it, we win one, we lose one, we win two, we lose two. It's not necessarily like we're, you know, we're not playing bad. You know, I, I want to be clear about that. It's just we're out working teams out every night. We just continue to have to work smarter. So, you know, we'll go back, we'll review things, we'll continue to work with our young group. Uh, it's a learning process with them. I mean, even uh, our forwards group, the majority of them are second year pros and we've got a lot of youth on the back end and uh, they're not going to learn it overnight. So as long as we can stay patient, continue to improve, uh, we'll be all right. All right, Coach, we appreciate your time. We'll see you tomorrow night. Thanks.